facto, my name is Karen. I make bookish and school related videos. Anyway, it's been quite a while since I filmed a video. I'm no longer in high school. Um, that's one thing. I also don't have long hair anymore. That's another. I shaved it for cancer. I'll leave links in the description for the foundation that I partnered with. I'm going to make it a goal to finish a book a week this this summer. I don't know if I can achieve that goal because I'm a very, very slow reader. First book that we are going to try and finish is The Sun is Also a Star by Nicola Yoon. This will be my first Nicola Yoon book that I have ever read. And I'm kind of excited because they just announced that there's going to be a movie for this book. And Yara Shahidi, love that girl. Um, she's going to be starring in this movie. So I need to read this book. It's also my friend's book, so I need to return it soon. But anyway, I have no other like actual update. Um, until I start college, I won't be making like any school related videos, of course. So this summer I am just preparing for school mentally, physically, all that. Um, I'm going to clean up my room. First, I want to do a little library book haul to show you what else I will be reading within the next two weeks. So first up is Children of Blood and Bone by Tomi Adeyemi. And I've been watching a lot of like different interviews and stuff of Tomi of when this book first released. And I'm super excited because I just watched Black Panther and in, in an interview, um, she said that if you love Black Panther, you'll love this book because of all the um, African culture in it. And so I am super excited. I really wanted a um, like a psychological read this summer. And so I'm going to try Into the Water by Paula Hawkins. That is my mess that I want to clean up. I got that. Ooh, I should go to Goodwill. Mm, I should go to Goodwill. Okay, so in here I had a bunch of stuff, like clothes, that I wanted to get rid of. This is all of that. I want to get rid of those. And then these are old, like, cheer uniforms. I'm gonna keep these because these are, like, special editions. So my head really hurts right now. And for some reason, if I'm horizontal, then the pain goes away. We're gonna read while laying down. <laughs> So I have read 50 pages so far of The Sun is Also a Star. Let me put you down. So far, I really like this book. All of the people that you meet so far, they kind of have this backstory. I love the pacing of this book. It's very fast. It is great for coming out of a slump. I'm going to be jumping into a longer book after this, so I'm glad that this book is kind of fast paced. Good morning. It is June 12th, 9 in the morning. I woke up at 7.30 great had breakfast trying this new thing where i actually wake up at a decent time in the morning so i'm just reading i'm 104 pages in so far so good um i should also document the fact that today is primary day in south carolina so i am going to go vote today um i plan that for reading um, for this book at least, I'm going to read 50 pages a day, uh, 50 pages, 50 pages at a time, up to 100 pages a day or more because I get really worn out when I read for long periods of time, so I think limiting myself to like 50 pages at a time is good, especially for a fast-paced book like this. So that's something you can try if you're in a reading slump. Um, let's do an outfit of the day because I'm vlogging. But anyway, I have this shirt. It says the features female, which is the appropriate day to wear this because it is primary day. I got this from Etsy and then I got these ripped jeans from Old Navy and this bracelet from an old teacher of mine. And yeah, that's my outfit of the day. Ow. Got my diploma right here. I have nothing else to do, so I am going to read. So I'm at the part in the story where Natasha and Daniel go into the store. I need to take a moment because I'm afraid of what's going to happen next. I am seven books behind schedule. That's not good. 45% done. It's only two in the afternoon and I'm not doing anything else today. So I think I'll be able to finish this book. I took the dust jacket off but I'm on page 192 and I'm loving it so far. I didn't think I would. I am on my last, like, how many pages are there? 20, 30 pages. And so here's my reaction to all that. Excuse me? 
Wow. Wow. The ending was really satisfying to me. I'm just, I'm just gonna sit here for a little longer. I don't know what to do now. I guess I just gotta move on to my next book. That's it for this reading vlog. I actually didn't plan on finishing this book in less than 12 hours. I'm a very, very slow reader, but I did. So now I can move on to this next book. Maybe I can get more than three books this month. Ugh. Thank you all for watching. If you like this reading vlog, please hit like and subscribe. And hopefully I'll be out with a new video soon. Who knows?